our beast just woke up. People have sometimes asked me because I get the impression of being a gobby, opinionated pig. <laughs> Why don't I stand for election if I could do better? There's a number of reasons for that. Firstly, I couldn't do better. How, how, could, I be, how could I do better? Um, the people you're representing, this isn't contempt. It's more exasperation. The people around here, if you got a bag and mill it and scattered it, that peck it. That's what you're dealing with. When you've got the, the media, all of it, pushing them one way, I think it's uh, it, it's something you won't overcome. Not unless there's something drastic and new happens. You know, it's like if you if you're in the car and you you pull over in Shrewsbury and you say, "Excuse me, mate, could could you point me um, to the way to, to Welshpool?" And half a dozen people go, "Yes, mate, it's that way. I went there this morning. It's over there. You got to follow that road there." And you turn around and go, actually, I'll go that way then. You know, if the, med if the media is convincing and shoving people in one direction, most people are good. It's very few that'll turn around and go, actually, I'll question that. There's something about you that I'll believe. You mean sincere. Secondly, look at the world of politics. Do you think I'd fit in? They'd laugh me out. They'd just laugh at me. They'd laugh till they wet their underpants at me. Stand out like a sore thumb, wouldn't fit in. It's the sort of world where um, they're all very slick and articulate and they can avoid a question by going in that direction and, and being very convincing and appearing to be very, very sincere and all this kind of stuff. They're snakes. And for all my faults, I honestly don't think I'm that bad. I'm bad, but I ain't that bad. Um, <clears throat> you, it, it just wouldn't happen. It, it, you know, it's uh, I'd get nowhere. I'd be a laughing stock, more of a laughing stock than I am now. But what'd be the point? You, you honestly, you, you wouldn't change anything. The thing is, as you get older in life, you do learn to pick your fights. And going into politics, I something that um, I'd be any good at. It's not something that I'd have any kind of a proficiency at. They'd rip me to shreds. People do seem to like me, but that won't make any difference. That that won't get you any kind of success, and, and would would I want to anyway? So it's uh, yeah, that, that's that's why I think with, with politics, it's an ego thing. I mean, you might say the same about this channel, but in truth, I've, I've done it because what I've said all along, it was a way initially to vent and get things off my chest because who the bloody hell's going to listen to me? My mates don't want to listen to it all, all the while. You know, me, me, me mum and dad, I'd just upset them if I was banging on about it. At least with a video channel, you can record yourself and people can take it or leave it. So... Very little ego involved. Ego, I'm in a pair of dirty pyjamas, sat in my bloody kitchen of a Thursday morning. Um, but the world of politics, of course, it's all ego. That's what it's all about, eh? Well, not all about, that's what it's a, a, a large part of it. Theatre. <coughs> and that's another thing, if I thought something was wrong, based on my values and my morality, I wouldn't go along with it. Well, that would get you nowhere in politics. You, you know, you have to be an independent and uh, they don't really get much success. I think, when all said and done, I think Lord Such kind of had the right idea. That was just turn up and take the mickey out of it. Just laugh at it. You know, look at the state of this. And just come up with nonsense policies just to, just to laugh at it. But um, yeah, I think with politicians, I think I'm a, I wouldn't fit in. I'm a straightforward kind of bloke. That's it. I'm, I'm fairly simple in, in all 
<coughs> meanings of the word. I ain't a smart bloke. I'm simple with the way I put myself across. But these people, the snakes, they do well in the corporate world because they're all Billy bullshits. They can talk the way all day long without having to do a, a decent day's work. And that's what I'm proficient and good at, and that's why they gravitate towards politics. And now I'm our world. For this morning, God bless.